What's up, y'all? This is Keith Cross, live at BlurryCon 2024. And I am author, creator of Day Black. And Day Black is about a slave that was bitten by a vampire in the cotton fields. Present day, he works as a tattoo artist as a way to collect blood. And he lives in a town where the sky is so dense with pollution, it blocks out the sun. So he's able to walk around day or night, hence the name Day Black. All of this can be found at dayblackcomic.com. All my socials are at Keith Cross. Well, my name is Cherry. I'm an artist and uh, graphic designer, kind of combined into one. And I go to conventions and work from home, selling pop art and art services. What's going on, everybody? My name is Tone Butter. I'm a vibrant, vibrant street and pop artist. Um, a lot of my work is super colorful, super bright. I have custom 3D printed uh, butter bears and Pokemon here today with me at BlurCon. Frankie and Luffy and Sanji are all wood cutouts. Me, you can find me on Instagram at butter, B-U-T-T-A underscore customs. You can find me at butter, B-U-T-T-A underscore customs. How you doing guys? My name is Ren McKenzie. I'm an illustrator out of Virginia and I'm here at BlurCon. This is my artwork. You can find me anywhere on social medias. Ren McKenzie, R-E-N-M-C-K-I-N-Z-I-E. My name is Kevin from Splash Cam Customs. I do sneaker designs, all custom, all hand painted designs by me. You can find me on Instagram here at splashcam underscore customs. Um, I answer all my DMs. You know, I get anything you like, um, any design, any character, anything you can have your mind to, I can put on a pair for you. Your imagination is endless. Abstract Mind. I'm a digital illustrator and painter. I like everything whimsical, surreal, and adding a magic touch to all your favorite characters and my originals. You can find me on Instagram at underscore abstractmind dot underscore. My name is Marlon McKinney, and I'm the author, illustrator of Conscious Culture Publishing. And what we do is we put out African historical fiction. We put out diverse multicultural stories. I mean, as you folks know right now, they're like banning a lot of books that are teaching about African history and our culture. So it's imperative. It's very important that we tell our own stories of our history, of our heroes, of the folks that brought so much to our community. And that's what Conscious Culture is doing. We have the genius of Egypt about Imhotep, one of the world's first multidisciplinary geniuses. We have Makita, the Queen of Sheba, the Ethiopian princess, queen, and about female leadership um, because it's very important out there, as well as a couple other books, Alice in Wonderland Remix and Uptown Dragon. So we always want to keep it diverse, we want to keep it real, and put that emphasis on our history and making sure that it's not lost or destroyed by folks out there that don't want us to grow. So take care, you have a good one. This is Conscious Culture signing off. Peace out, y'all.